uh, pocket of the frame. Well, this is, uh, as as it in, what we've done here is we've just plugged the two exterior weep holes. Here. So I've just plugged them with this pressure sensitive tape. And we're just putting some, here, can you hold this pair? Absolutely. We're just putting some water here in around the hardware for the window. It looks like these holes here probably held something at one point. And as soon as I pour it in here, we can see water come out instantaneously from out behind the window. So anything that gets behind that caulking comes in the building. Nothing goes, goes out. There's no, no subsill and there's no weeping of that caulking. So that's a, that's a pretty good test and that explains why we've got so much so much corrosion at the sill here at the stub track. I'm going to load that up on um, YouTube. Yeah. Okay, so we're going to just do a cut test here. Uh, cut test. We're going to do a little uh, sill flood test here. Same as we've done on the other windows. Again, uh, this is just flooding in here top of the wood. You can see it's spreading. See the movement of water here. So it's flowing in pretty quickly. You can see here. There we are. And it's flowing in right where you see those dark stains. And right sort of where you see these dark stains. So I, I kind of think that that's probably uh, you know, from time to time, you get a bit of rainwater. It washes the dirt in mm -hmm. and runs it along. Because yeah. normally, you see this black is on this side because yeah. the air is moving through the wall. Yeah, it's on the outside usually. So see here, that's that's almost identical patterning. See, that's an identical pattern to mm -hmm. that. <clears throat> so I think that this is happening, but not on a frequency. Oh, you know what? Look at that. It, it exactly matches the rust on that stud. Oh, really? Identically. So we oh, know yeah. for sure that this is water staining yeah. um, because it has rusted that stud out there right in exactly the same spot. So I think we can definitely correlate this leakage with that stud damage. Yeah. Okay, this is the right hand corner of the right window. We're gonna just uh, do the same uh, sill flood test. Again, we haven't blocked the drain holes because they don't seem to work. Um, we're gonna pour it in along there and we'll see if it comes out this corner as well. Uh, yeah, we've been the outer track. Okay, so um, we've had this going now for about uh, three or four minutes. Now we're starting to see water draining down the inside of the wall here. Coming from that corner of the window. Draining down inside the wall. Where do you want to start okay. up here? Uh, we're just going to test this window here using a sill flood test. We haven't even blocked the exterior weep holes, so they're open. We're just going to lay it in here like that. Just slowly lay it in. And you can see here, virtually as soon as we pour water in there, we start to get the flooding underneath and you can see, look at the amount of water that's pouring in there. Basically, a very good percentage of that water is is coming in. No kidding. You can see it flowing there. Yeah. So we've only put, you know, what, a half cup of water. So now, let's see where that water's going and we'll track it and see if we can... So it's running down the wall and that's coming in behind there, right over top of that sort of stained area that we saw. You see, we, there is some faint water stains there, mm -hmm. which basically yeah. tell me that that does that periodically and then dries back out again. Yeah. 